We were discussing how to, uh, to get people to use CNC technology and digital fabrication without necessarily having the skills to, um, uh, to use the 3D program and so on. And uh, one of the things that are usually a problem is if you want to interface to something, if you want to take measurements of a real world object and put that into a digital uh, design. So we were thinking of different ways to do this. One of the things you could do, I mean, usually you would use a caliber like this one, like an electronic caliber to kind of take measurements. So we thought that we might want to take this a step further. So what we came up with was this, uh, this measuring device. It's basically just three encoders, one in the base, one in the elbow, uh, one in the shoulder and one in the elbow. And we should be able to figure out the position of this tip accurately and use that for taking measurements and so on. We have uh, all the encoders hooked up to this Arduino and the Arduino is hooked up to this processing sketch that will take the angle and uh, calculate the, the position of the tip of the measuring tool. So if we run this program, one thing to note is that we put the tip in a known position. And then the, this square is, represents the, the actual board over here. And when, if I move the tip from side to side and up and down, it records the position. The boundaries of this box is the boundaries of the actual pad that we do our measurements on. I'm going to put like a, a piece of rubber down here because uh, if we want to measure things, we want them to be kind of fixed. So I'm going to try and measure this, this uh, power supply. Uh, it could be useful if you want to put it into an existing design. So what I'm going to do first is to just lay down on this board. And then I'm going to use the program to record all the holes in here. I'm going to put the pointer on a hole and I'm just going to press a key on, uh, on the keyboard and it will record the, the position of these holes. So on the screen now, we have the, the position of the different holes. So now we want to, uh, to take the outline of the, of the box itself. Even though we see the coordinates uh, in a two-dimensional coordinate system, they're actually three-dimensional. So all these, uh, all these um, positions are recorded in, in a three-dimensional coordinate system. For instance, I can measure some, something that is in the space. If I do like some uh, some measurements on this on the surface of this space, you see how these things relate to each other. Så hullerne passer. Ja. Det fungerer. 